As a general principle, as atoms in a substance are heated, they move about or vibrate more. And when they're cooled, they move less. Generally, the more atoms move, the lighter the substance is, the less they move, the denser it is. Generally, solids are denser than liquids, liquids denser than gases. However, there is an exception. When water is cooled, it does get denser and denser until it reaches the point of 4 degrees centigrade. Then a really strange thing happens. It starts to become less dense. When water turns from a liquid into a solid, it becomes even less dense. That's hence why ice floats on the water. The reverse of what happens in when most liquids are cooled. Why is this interesting though? It means that ice on rivers, lakes and ponds may not be as thick as you think it should be. So you need to be careful when moving on ice. In most rivers, lakes and ponds, unless it is very cold for a very long time, the water still should be at 4 degrees centigrade at the bottom, allowing fish and other creatures to survive, so long as they can get a source of oxygen. Water means that the hotter areas of the world, the bottom of the lake, will also be coolest. Life on the planet would certainly look a lot different if lakes and rivers and ponds froze completely with relative ease.